Hello everyone, this is William Armstrong with a brief retrospect of the Dell Inspiron Duo computer hybrid laptop tablet that was released in 2011 by Dell with Windows 7 Home Premium on it. This is the tablet, or this is the laptop tablet hybrid I ordered off eBay. I paid the seller $52 because the computer was $40, 40 something dollars, and I paid the seller $52 to get it. It came with no charger, but I already have a charger that fits with it, and it charges the battery in it. But the downside is, is that when I took it apart carefully to make sure there's nothing else wrong in it, um, the flex ribbon cable, I'll show you. This itty bitty flex ribbon cable from another, from another Dell computer, well, the one that was already in this machine right here actually managed to break inadvertently where this flex ribbon cable broke in it making the touchpad unusable it basically just rendered the touchpad useless now it's useless but the keyboard works mainly more the keyboard works but this actually has a touch screen in it where I can tap and touch on it so I can use the touch screen as the mouse but I have to use the keyboard to type on it it has Bluetooth and Wi-Fi in it, and it works. It, it also has an option for a cellular modem card, like a cell modem card on the back of it. I'll have to turn it around and show you. It comes with two USB ports, headphone, a headphone in or headphone output. There's the little Duo dock connector there. There's the speakers here and here. There's the power jack. The USB ports and headphone are right here. This computer contains a very slim hard drive. I put in a Samsung 256 gig SSD that fits in here. This right here is our movable panel that if I slide upward on it, it reveals a cellular, an option for a cellular SIM card for cell technology such as like WiMAX, like a cellular like a cellular modem option right there. You can put a cellular modem option use it on the go. Anywhere in town, anything like that. Now you can't see it, but there is a Windows 7 Home Premium serial sticker that I'm covering up with the phone's light so you can't see it. But I'm completely covering up with that with the phone's light so it is obscured, hard to read, and hard to see, but... The Windows 7 Home Premium serial key is right there on the bottom of it underneath this removable cover. The battery is actually sealed in at the bottom down here, but this just reveals a cellular a SIM card data plan or a SIM card data slot where you can get tablet data on a SIM card and put it in here to use it as a tablet on the go through a cellular carrier back in 2011. This is the Windows 7 certificate serial key there, right there. This hard drive has Windows 7 Professional on it, but the problem is when I booted it, it booted up with an error recovery. I booted into safe mode, I got into safe mode fine. When I try to boot in normal mode, it immediately crashes into a blue screen and restarts. So Windows 7 is completely gone flimsy on here. Windows 7 is unsupported, but this has like a bad driver on it that is causing the crash. I don't I've swapped it with a Samsung SSD, so I'm not going to really use Windows 7 because Windows 7 is too out of date. But other than that, this is William Armstrong signing out. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.